College, college. Uh, let me, let me, I hated college. I hated it. I, didn't, I never liked college. I was so glad when I was done with college. Because like, you see what it is with college, right? When I went college, I felt none of the teachers cared. You know what I mean? You could be one of the teachers watching this right now. And yeah, if you're watching it, you're a prick, innit? <laughs> so, some, of that, the, lot, some of the tutors were cool, but I felt when I was in college, you know, the difference with school is that some of the, I felt like some of the teachers cared a bit more. The ones in, in college, they didn't care. When I was in college as well, uh, college, got, I got introduced to EMA. Oh my gosh, EMA, Education Maintenance Allowance, yeah? This was to help you, yeah, buy books, you know what I mean? Help you for your studies. I weren't hearing that. All I was hearing was free money. Hold on, so what, hold on, wait, wait. So I get money to what, 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 just to go college, yeah? Now sign me up for that, bro. Sign me up, I'm 30 pound a week. Sign me up for that. There was a catch. You see with EMA, it was about your attendance. So if your attendance wasn't good, you wouldn't get no money. How it used to work, you had to have 100% attendance for you to get EMA. So imagine, like, if you're late once, that's it. Money's shut down, yeah? Your money, you cut it off. They cut it off, man. They don't cut off your money. 100% attendance for that week, right? You get 30 pounds every week. And then in January, yeah, in January, they give, they'll give, they give you a bonus. <laughs> Why? I don't know. But they'll give you a bonus of 100 pounds, yeah, in January. And you finish your term, then when you enroll again, yeah, then you get another 100 pounds. Now, the root, like EMA, it was determined for your parents' income. So not everyone was getting EMA, yeah? So I was getting 30 pounds, yeah? Because I lived in a single parent household my mum earned under like the threshold basically. So some people was getting 20 pounds, other people was getting 10. 10 pounds, you know? There were some people out there getting 10 pound EMA. What, what was the point? <laughs> 17, getting little change pocket money. I'm all right, man. <laughs> you know, some people like, yeah, man used to get EMA. Like the majority of the working class, I felt was all getting 30 pounds. When you met someone that got 10 pounds, you're like, right, I don't know if you need this, you know. <laughs> I don't think you need this, what, 10 pounds? You're coming in early every day for 10 pounds. To meet some people who, they weren't getting here, mate, because their parents were, 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 you know, were doing well, you know what I mean? They were doing all right. But they still complain, you know. No, this isn't fair. This isn't fair, why are you getting 30 pounds? That's not fair. Bro, your parents are rich, bro. But allow it, man. Allow it, Rupert, bro. I used to work in my college. We used to get like this little yellow booklet, right? And then with the yellow booklet, your tutor would have to sign this, right? Have to sign it. Sometimes they might have to stamp it as well. What I used to do, right? I think, oh, do you know what? What I'm gonna do? I'll save this one. One time, I saved about six. Oh, how come you have it in six? You really gotta do that lie, like to the teacher. Oh, oh, miss, you know what? I'm so sorry, man. I've been so busy with my with my studying exams. Have... That's great. That's amazing. Shut up, man. Process that stuff, bro. Man needs my pee. <laughs> there were some people that were like really lying to the teachers. I oh, miss, miss, I know I was late, yeah, but what it is, I've got a lot of stuff going on at home. You see what I'm saying? Because what it is, you know what I'm saying? Like, you see my dad, yeah, like my dad, obviously, like, you know what I'm saying? Like, he works late, so I had to wait up for him one time, and, you know, um, I waited up and I fell asleep and I woke up, yeah, and then what happened is, you know, on my block, right, they, they, they're fixing the lifts, so I had to walk down 10, 10 stairs, and, you know, walk down the stairs, basically, like, the, you know, the, the bus was. There's also some people that had a part time job as well. I really respected them guys. You know what I mean? Because they might have a little part-time job and they were getting EMA. What? Money, man? Is that you, yeah? What, my lady? <laughs> yeah. That's them guys that had a little moped. Girls are looking at him like, oh, my days, he's the You need to let me know in your room, if you need. But in college, you had so many groups, I found. When I was in college, there were so many groups. You know what I mean? You had the olders. Now, you see the olders. They weren't here to be anyone's friend. They're here to do their course. You know what I mean? Get their grades, go uni and whatever. Some of them will have kids and stuff. You know what I mean? They'll always be like, hey, listen, I need to go because, you know what I'm saying, my son's sick. You know, teacher can't say nothing, you know? Same age as them. <laughs> can't say nothing. You have the international students as well. A lot of international students you get at uni because them international students are balling. Yeah, they, you know them balling international students. These guys are wearing Burberry jackets. Normal, for fun, everyday stuff. Yeah, everyday. You know that like, they're wearing brands, right? Like, they'll wear like Gucci slip-on shoes and you would never know. You'll look close, you're like, oh, bro, Gucci, yeah? Oh, bro, bro. You're making man like, man like Jung now, you know? Man like Jung now, you know? Bare bees, 
than that. <laughs> you see, in college, you had these like international students, right? You know, a lot of the time in my college, they was doing IT. Yeah, these guys, they they stick. They they're with their brethrens, in it. Yeah, they're not trying to ban out with you or your friends. They don't know you, in it. They're sticking with their brethren, with their friends, yeah? The, the cool people at university, I always found, were the people that done sports science. Oh, these guys, would they're coming in the tracksuit. Gang of them, you know what I mean? Yeah, it was um, sports science. You do physio, yeah, might do football coaching. Oh wait, a lot of the guys always played football as well. Always played football. Semi-pro, like, they were playing like a Ryman's league team, like Sutton United or one of them ones, you know what I mean? Like, no, 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 no disrespect to them Sutton United. Cause they, they got some good ballers there. But these guys were acting like they played for Arsenal. They might one done, yeah? He had a wash bag. <laughs> Why have you got a wash bag? You might have had a wash bag. <laughs> they were cool, man. They, they were like the, you know, like in America, you got the jocks, like the people that done the sports science. That was them. You had the people that would, you might see them for the first two months of your course, they was gone. That, you know, you know what I mean? Like they'd sign up, they was like, you know what, this ain't for me, this ain't for me. But, yeah, they would try and come back, you know, two, three months down the line. Yeah, we said, Miss Sorry, man. They get, they get, they get let back in, you know. Then you had the other group of guys at college who clearly was up to illegal activities, yeah? These guys were getting EMA as well. Yeah, they were wearing like, you know, like they were wearing like the Paradas. You know that, you know them Parada, them shiny Paradas, the paint and one? Have a BMW, a BMW. Whoa, 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 why are you here? Why are you here, bro? And you also had these other people that would be in your college, right? They didn't even go to your college, but it was always there, yeah? They was always, they'd be chilling in the common room. Bookworms, now you see the bookworms? The, the bookworms, they was in the library 24 seven. When I say 24 seven, yeah? I mean like, some summer's done, you're finished, you're good to go, yeah? College is still open. These guys are in the library. They're in the library. They're already doing they're doing coursework for the next term. Yeah, when it comes to the library, the, like the bookworms, they're always in the library. Six, seven o'clock. They finish their course at three o'clock, they're gonna go to the library, do a bit of revision. Because we all know the library, yeah? Now the library will always get busy, right? When there's exams coming up, you know when the library is busy is when you see people in the library that like you ever seen that guy in the library is like oh hey, bro, oh hey, listen, oh hey, bro, listen, I'm gonna steal this book here, bro. No, 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 I'm not paying for this book, I'm, bro. I can't, I can't be here right now, bro. And you just completed your first year of college. Now you're on to your second year of college. Applying for universities, it's, it's getting real now. Understanding the UCAS system. I was looking at universities. Some, some teachers will humble you. They'll, they'll let you know. I think the point system because you know, I don't know. If you, I'd be better off trying. You know. Um, you know, they'll give you some university you've never heard of. University of Dover, what? No vibes, who goes there? You won't tell no one that. What university you go to? I went to University of Dover still. <laughs> also, some colleges, like they have people from secondary schools. That's like the bad breed kids, innit? 14 year olds just in college, roaming around like, what is what these 14 year olds doing, bro? You know, you finish college now, but it's all about Exam results. Woo! Exam results are real. Them A-level results. When it came to GCSE results, I knew I was like failing already, innit? It's be real, innit? Like everyone's opening their results. Oh man, oh my god, congratulations, you got five stars. You got some people that got some wicked grades are like, oh my okay, I've got oh, okay, I've got nine A stars and an A. And they're disappointed! Bro, man sitting there with D's and <laughs> Some kids crying. They cry. Oh my god, oh, I'm so upset. What's wrong, Beth? What's wrong? I'm so upset. I got like nine eight stars and I've got an eight. Let me tell you something. Me and my dyslexic brethren, we're sitting there like, bro, hey, man, got D and a U. A level results. Woo! That's some real stuff there. This is this is about getting into uni, yeah? Because the thing is, right, if you repeat your second year in college, all your brethren are gone. They're all gone. They're all gone to university. College, I'm not gonna lie, college for me wasn't really the boom diggity split. Weren't really the one for me, I'm not gonna lie. But yeah, if you enjoyed this video, look, this is the bit where, you know, YouTubers do the whole like, look, if you enjoy it, like and subscribe. Look, if you like it, subscribe, innit? Like, I, I'm not on the forcing stuff, innit? You know what I mean? But yeah, peace. <laughs>